Alright, I'm back, and I'm now in the game, but I'm recording with Fraps instead, so, uh, um, we should actually be able to see something this time. So I'm in the game, and we're gonna go multiplayer, and we're gonna log in with our account that's defunct. You can log in with pretty much any account there. And sign in. Uh, happily, the, uh, the, uh, Skywings client extender makes it so we don't have to wait there. And then we're going to go and join Internet Game. Now, uh, if we recall, our world should be listed under Persistent World Action. So we'll go to Persistent World Action, and sure enough, there it is. Uh, our Legends module, my servers, the module name, and all of our other settings are listed there. So that's what we wanted to see. And all we do now is select it and hit Connect. We put in our password, which was uh, my password and hit OK. Now what's happening is all of our files are getting downloaded. Now, of course, it's quick. There's not a lot of them uh, because we have a little tiny module with a little tiny hack pack. But what's happened uh, at this point now is in our local Windows 7 computer, a directory in our modules has been created called My Server. Again, if this was the same name as the module, uh, guess what? <laughs> Boom. And, uh, but we, we don't have that problem. So, uh, a directory has been created called my server, and in that directory, a bunch of files have been downloaded, <clears throat> like the areas, uh, walk mesh files, and things like that. Uh, again, if we have, you know, 50 areas in our, in our persistent world, this would take much longer. If we had a big 100 meg hack pack, then that would all get downloaded right now. As we can see over here, our little HTML file that we created and configured in the NWN2 player any file is showing up. So you can again put news and information in there. And uh, now what it's doing is it's waiting for us to select character. If we were a returning player, we would just go and select our existing uh, character on the server, but because our server is brand new and we've never logged into it before, we don't have a character. So we're going to have to do a create character. So I'm just going to do a you know, recommend all the way through. <laughs> just so we can get through this quick, because we're not actually going to be playing on the server, because there's not much to do. And we're just going to go, George, George, the great, there we go, finish. Now it's going to log us into our world, and there it is. Now we are on our fantastic little persistent world. So that's it. We are now running a full-blown persistent world complete with NWNX and MySQL backend database. Now, as a developer of my persistent world, I would go back and, and start adding, you know, Legends plugins. <laughs> shameless, shameless plug there. And uh, any other of the great uh, community-created content that's out there. There's plenty of really cool prefabs for areas if you're not good at area designing like me. Um, I have no clue how to create areas. I'm awful at it. I do manage to bungle my way through, but there are a lot of fantastic prefabs out there. There's a lot of cool code out there for scripts and things. Uh, again, I have my own Legends plugins uh, that you can take a look at and leverage and add to your precision world. And now you're at the point where you can go ahead and, and start creating, start building a fantastic persistent world for someone like me to come along and, and log in and, and play on it. Um, Again, we're going to go back real quick and, and review um, some of the some of the things that you'll want to do and how to maintain your persistent world, how to restage things and make changes and stuff like that. So that'll be a quick uh, little, just a refresher uh, recap of what we did. And again, if someone were to log in, if someone else knew the password, someone else could log in and we could play here together. So that's it. I'm going to log out and stop using Fraps because it's I only use it for this part. And uh, I'll see you back at the tool set.